Lee, the Schumer, it's an honor uh, to be here and to stand with you as uh, well as standing with Senator Heinrich and Senator Smith, uh, and of course uh, with Representative Don Beyer, uh, the top Democrat, lead Democrat uh, on the Joint Economic Committee, as well as Gwen Moore, one of our leading voices within the Congress on behalf of everyday Americans uh, and working families. It is time for the extreme MAGA Republicans to end the brinksmanship, end the partisan ship and in the gamesmanship and do what is necessary on behalf of everyday Americans to raise the debt ceiling so America can pay the bills that have already been incurred. As Leader Schumer has pointed out time and time again, including three times during the administration of the prior president, House Democrats and Senate Democrats came together to lift the debt ceiling without fanfare, without politicking, without brinksmanship, because it's the right thing to do for the American people. We can have a conversation about the future of spending in America. We've indicated that time and time again. President Biden has released his budget released his plan for investing in the health, safety, and economic well-being of the American people moving forward. The Republican budget plan is hiding in the witness protection program. <laughs> it's in an undisclosed location. They have failed to present it at all. They're not serious about moving forward in a sensible way. What, what they are serious about is defaulting on our nation's debt. Unless they can extract extreme cuts to things like Social Security and Medicare, which we will always work to strengthen and protect. The problem with this approach on the extreme MAGA Republican side is that, as Leader Schumer has pointed out, as the JEC has eloquently and comprehensively pointed out, it will have cat catastrophic consequences for everyday Americans. Dramatically increase costs for homeowners, for students, adversely impact retirees, Social Security recipients, Medicare recipients. A default on our nation's debt will hurt people all throughout America in every category imaginable. So it's time for the extreme MAGA Republicans in the House to come together with everyone else in the Capitol and the administration to do what's necessary to raise the debt ceiling and then let's sit down and have a conversation about the future investments that need to be made on behalf of the American people. We can only do that when the extreme MAGA Republicans show us your plan because the current objective that you have to simply threaten a default on our nation's debt is unacceptable. It's now my honor to yield to, okay, I was going to yield to my leader from Brooklyn, but I'll yield back uh, to the distinguished uh, senator from New Mexico, uh, the top Democrat who's chairing the effort related to the Joint Economic Committee, Martin Heinrich. Thank you, Leader.